this is carbon dioxide molecule, carbon, oxygen, oxygen atoms. As what we can see, this CO2 molecule has symmetrical linear shape. And then we want to find out the symmetric elements operation for this molecule. This molecule is linear, so we find the main axis for this molecule is C infinity, which is this exists passing through all atoms parallel with the shape of this molecule. So we write the exist like this and label C infinity. And then we find out this molecule is symmetrical linear. It means that we can rotate 180 degree through C to exist. So where is the C to exist? The C to exist is passing through the carbon atom. So we can rotate 180 degree. The oxygen atom can rotate 180. We'll stop here. We get the same configuration. C to exist can be here, can be here, can be here from the top view, and also can be here and here as well. So there are many more C2 exists through the carbon atom. So we can write the symmetric element separation for this carbon dioxide molecule identity C1 C infinity and another one is infinity C2. The next symmetric elements operation is reflection. So we can see that this molecule has plane cutting through all atoms. We get the same configuration. So this plane actually parallel with the main axis C infinity. So this is vertical plane. So the plane can be cut through here or cut through here like this as well so it means that there are many more sigma v through this molecule and then we find another plane which is cut through the carbon atom here. So cut through this carbon atom, we get the same configuration. Oxygen reflect through this plane will be oxygen as well. Same configuration and this plane is perpendicular with the main axis. So this plane is known as horizontal plane. Next, we find the center of symmetry. So we put the center here and we look at the oxygen atoms inverse through this center. We get the same configuration. So center of symmetry equivalent with the S2 symmetry elements operation. Alright, so now we want to determine the point group for this molecule. So we look at the shape of this molecule, linear, symmetrical. So the point group for this molecule is high symmetry point group which is D infinity H.